Tickets for day two sold out in less than a minute, with men and women sitting together in the theater Saudi Information Minister Awad Al Awad, Wright, and AMC Entertainment's Chief Executive Adam Aaron posing for a photograph with small popcorn buckets at the AMC Cinema in Riyadh. Photo, Bundar Aljaloud, AFP, Getty Images Film fans in Saudi Arabia could end paying $35, 131 Saudi rials, for movie tickets, including taxes, according to the head of the U.S. firm AMC Entertainment Holdings. Demand at $20 of ticket was so strong at a theater in Riyadh run by AMC Entertainment Holdings that Chief Executive Officer Adam Aaron was predicting far higher prices by summer, when the company will complete refurbishments that include new seating. I'll bet you we are closer to $30 to $35. Aaron said Monday in Las Vegas at CinemaCon, the industry convention for the National Association of Theater Owners. He said men and women sat together in Riyadh and that tickets for day two sold out in less than a minute. The convention kicked off with a panel on Saudi Arabia's decision to lift a 35-year ban on theaters and the opportunities there. Andrew Cripps, president of International Theatrical Distribution for 20th Century Fox, flagged concerns about a 25% tax on entertainment, which he described as one of the highest in the region. He also said that on opening night, some moviegoers in the kingdom were recording what was on screen, in this case, Marvel's Black Panther. Hopefully that is not a habit, Cripps said. There are lots of issues to flesh out and discuss but overriding sentiment is that it's a tremendously exciting opportunity. Fox's animated tale about a bull, Ferdinand, is likely to be the first Fox film to hit Saudi Arabia, Cripps said. Aaron said Warner Brothers' Rampage featuring Dwayne Johnson had cleared censors and Disney's Avengers Infinity War is going through that process now.